coolest cutscene in it. Oh shit, this is a legendary cutscene. What's going on guys? I'm BD Cambria. Welcome back to another episode of Phantom Gaming. Today in our Destiny 2 video, I just wanted to go over a couple things because this past week has been a little bit slow as far as like the mysteries going. A few things got unveiled and a few things have changed my thought process on a few of the things that we were trying to discover. First of all though, Guys, 600 subs, I am ecstatic. Thank you all so much. I, I mean, 600. I've only been YouTubing for maybe two months. So the fact that our community is growing here is making me just, I, I couldn't be happier. I couldn't be happier. Um, also wanted to give a special shout out to my boy, I Tread in this video uh it was his birthday this last weekend and he is also a fellow youtuber if you guys haven't seen him i'm gonna leave a link down in the description make sure you guys go over and check out his videos give him likes give him subs and share his content too he actually has some pretty wicked uh montages like wicked um i wanted to talk in response to a few of the comments on my last videos, uh, to you, Jared McNish, you sent me an image of a code found in the Shrieker mission that I was doing towards the end. I took a look at that, didn't see it, I, d I just couldn't, couldn't figure it out. It's definitely a code, I just can't really tell. I think that's one of those things that, you know, we're looking a little too hard. Uh, but it is definitely different and interesting. It's way different than any of the other codes that you see in there. So you might have something there. It might be a code. Uh, maybe it's some sort of Morse code. You could try putting that in and deciphering it as a type of Morse code. But uh, other than that, I'm not quite sure what to tell you, but it was very interesting. So I thank you for following up with me on that. Um, a lot of you asked... The question if the shriekers were in the patrols as well the answer is no due to the fact that you can't even get into that area in the patrols or while in patrol uh, to like if you were to get to that mission you, you just can't access that area um, however there may be a way to wall hack it I was trying to and I had no luck so if any of you uh, are able to get to that area via wall hacking on Titan, um, please let me know how. I would love to be able to get in there and explore on my own. Uh, two days ago, um, forgive me if I butcher your name, dude, uh, but uh, Hennicide sent me a message saying, try killing all the Shriekers within a time frame or all at once if possible. We tried that. We tried killing him as fast as we could. We we didn't kill him as fast as you did. I'll put it that way. But we did try killing him as fast as we could, and we tried killing them in order. Uh, some of you also asked, you know, try sniping them in order. And we, we did. We went back, and we killed them all in order, and nothing happened for us. We had no luck. But, uh, you know, I mean, shout out to Hennicide. He actually grinded these last two days... I don't know if it was just him or with his friends. I believe it was with his friends. But uh, he came back and he shared his results. And I'm actually going to put them up here for you on screen. Um, he apparently got some sort of a ding at the end. They each took two and they were able to kill him in about three to four seconds. And there was some sort of a ding at the end. So that what that says to me is it's a trigger. It's triggering something. It's triggering a doorway. Uh, it could just be that it was completed. Or it could be a bell or something saying, hey, you did it wrong. So, But either way, I think it's a trigger. So the next step would be saying, okay, 
we have something here. We have Shriekers, and yes, all of you in the comment section who have been telling me that they've been there since the beginning. Yeah, I mean, no shit they've been there since the beginning. It's just now that we're starting to find them. And honestly, if you think that these Shriekers are directly on the path, like some of you are saying, y'all really need to learn how to drive because some of these Shriekers are like way up over a rock and then around to the right and then taking a left turn and in a dark corner. So I don't, I don't know what mission you were following on the main road, but whatever. Anyway, they were hidden. So I think, uh, I think it's definitely worth investigating more. Um, I do know that they are bringing heroic daily missions back in September. And that I think is when we're going to be seeing black spindle guys, just because it was in a heroic daily before. And I think, you know, it would only make sense if it was in a heroic daily again, uh, probably another mission like the last one related in the same way. Um, but it doesn't hurt to keep looking for other things as we are. Like, it's there's still other things on Titan. I think something's definitely on Titan. I think something's definitely related in the Sabathun Song Strike. And we also need to figure out these nine dots in the final emblem that we've been looking for uh, over the past couple weeks as well. I'm going to be searching for that probably a little bit over the next couple days. Um, I'm hoping that with this week's reset, we get uh, a couple new Ikora's missions that are a little, you know, more related to what we're looking for. I didn't think this week's really had anything, but I am excited if Ikora has the very first mission where you're going and getting the gunk off the pistons. Something to me says that there might be something unique in that mission that hasn't been found yet that could have something to do with that emblem. I don't know, guys. I just, I try to find these things. I try to solve these mysteries. If you guys want to be, you know, skeptical and say, oh, no, it doesn't exist. I mean, that's fine. But don't ruin it for the people that do want to go and search and do want to enjoy the game after they've completed all the rest of the content. This is what we do. This is what I like to do. So it's what I'm going to do. But uh, moving forward, when we hit 1,000 subs, guys, I am going to be doing a $20 PSN or Xbox uh, gift card giveaway. So thank you guys again for the 600 subs. And again, if you guys haven't seen iTread, uh, make sure to go and subscribe to his channel. His link will be in the description below. Um, other than that, we didn't really uh, get that much done this past week. It was a regular week in Destiny. I got my Skyburners Catalyst done. I got the Vigilance Wing Catalyst. I'm pretty excited to use that. Um, yeah, but uh, I hope you guys, uh, I wanted to drop this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I wanted to have you guys, ask you guys to comment down below and let me know what kind of things you want me to be posting in the future. Like what, do, do we want to focus more on the Pyramidian first? And Black Spindle, which honestly, I don't think we're going to see anything towards Black Spindle anymore until the next update. Until September. Until Forsaken. It's just... It's, I, I just don't see it anymore. I, I thought for a little bit that there could have been a chance at a secret quest for it, especially since the Catalyst was in the game, but the thing that did it for me is the fact that they're bringing heroic daily missions back, and to me... It just doesn't make any more sense but to have it in a heroic daily mission, just like before. So, that doesn't mean that there's not other things you have to find. I mean, there's plenty of other things you have to find in this game. There's plenty of things that are hidden that nobody has a, any idea of yet. So, I just wanted to see what kind of what kind of direction you want to go from here because I want this to be built into a community and we can communicate with each other. I've tried to do my best at reading the comments and responding to them personally. Uh, some of you even got my PSNs and were able to send me images and other things and messages and private messages and things like that. I, I want to interact with you guys. I want to be able to help you guys go out and discover things for yourselves and then come back to me and us as a community collectively can make a video. So 
Let me know what you want to do going forward from here. I just wanted to thank you guys all for the 600 subs. And I wanted to get this video to you guys out there so you can see what my thoughts were moving forward with these mysteries. And I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. Please leave a like and make sure you guys hit that sub button. You guys have no idea how much it helps me out. And we are going straight to a thousand. I'm giving away that PSN card. You guys can use it to, I don't know, you could use it at uh, Tess Eververse or whatever her name is. Get yourself some new shaders. I don't know what you want. I personally, I just spent 20 bucks on Zombies Chronicles because Black Ops 3 is free right now. And <laughs> I only like to play zombies. So there we go. Zombie Chronicles is on sale. So there we go. We've got all the maps. That's what I'm doing this evening. But uh, I hope you guys have a wonderful evening, and I will catch you all in the next one. Take care. Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! Oh, my God! What is going yep. Oh, my God!